So we're just going to ask you a couple of quick questions. You've got around 15 seconds to answer each one. Right. So just relax, clear your mind and take a deep breath. What do you like about Swansea? Um, I love Swansea because there's like so much to do. There's a massive like emerging art scene. There's loads of new things happening like Upland Market's just started. Brilliant live music scene and um, sort of alternative performance. And the beaches are amazing, especially in the summer. Do you have any strange phobias? Um, yeah, I don't like seaweed. If it touches my leg, I think I've been attacked and then I scream. Oh, and I don't like goat's cheese. It's not a phobia, but it makes me go like that. Why should students choose this university? It's an amazing university. Um, what I really like about it is you've got your sort of studies and you learn all about you know the kind of academic side of your subject, but there's so many like practical things you can get involved in on the course as well. Um, <clears throat> there's like real opportunities for you to try out your skills in real life situations. Um, I think that's brilliant because then when you leave, not only have you got a degree, you've also got like loads of experience as well. Um, it's also really friendly as well with a huge kind of. Um, I don't know, range of people that come here, so you always find your little niche and, and make friends easily. Cats or dogs? <gasps> I'm not a massive animal fan. Um, I'd rather have a dog because cats, I don't think they're very loyal, like they'd let you burn in a building, but <laughs> a dog would come and save you. What's your role and history with the university? Okay, my, my role with the university is complicated. Um, I came here initially as a student um, about five years ago and studied performing arts, which is brilliant. Um, really enjoyed the course. And then when I was studying, I started getting involved in um, some of the community projects while I was here. And then I started teaching and working here part time, and I'm full time. So I am the community engagement coordinator here. And I also teach arts marketing on the performing arts course. So I kind of have lots of hats graduates, staff, and lots of different things. Theatre or film? <gasps> My ego says film but I love theatre. Um, I like the the liveness of it and the fact that it's it's always uh, there's a narrative more to theatre where film is much more sort of mishmash but yeah if I was offered a massive role in a film I'd take it. So what's community engagement and why should students get involved? Um, community, community engagement is literally what it says, we engage with um, various groups and sections of the community. Um, it's great because we've got so much resource here that it's so beneficial to um, a community such as space and students. But then we get so much back from these projects as well. Um, the students who, who work on the projects gain amazing employability skills. Um, it makes them think very differently about the studies that they're doing as well. So, um, you know, for example, I work with a film student who wanted to make films. He got involved in some of my projects and now is um, mentoring and teaching young people um, like film skills. So it can really sort of shift around. It makes you think bigger, I think, about what you can achieve. Um, also, a lot of the projects are great fun as well. You know, we're planning a festival at the moment, and and that doesn't feel like studies. You know, it's it's brilliant fun. So, I think that's it. It just adds that extra dimension and really makes you um, far more interesting as a person when you graduate, when you've got all this this experience. Jam or marmite? Marmite. I can't function without marmite toast in the morning. Name some good things about the course you teach. Okay, well, um, I teach arts marketing on the performing arts course, but the performing arts course is, um, I like it because it's like, it's not just acting, they teach you loads of different skills as well, so it's loads of different performance genres, um, you can study applied theatre, so sort of perhaps becoming a practitioner and working with vulnerable groups, you can learn like, arts marketing, which I teach, which really helps you promote yourself and your shows and, and generally get bums on seats for any events. Um, you know, there's technical theatre on there. It's brilliant, it's, it's a fantastic course. Um, everyone can have a go and everyone finds something that they're good at on it as well. So it's, um, I don't know, it's just, it's not narrow at all. It really sort of encourages you to find your niche and what you're good at. Name and an interesting fact about yourself. Ah, um, an interesting fact about myself. Um, I can't think of anything interesting. Um, I don't have any interesting facts. <laughs> How do you think students can get the most out of university? Oh my god, get involved in everything. Don't just come and turn up to your lectures and make notes. See what's going on, get involved. Um, you know, all my community projects you can get involved in, whatever course you're on. It's a great way of making friends, collaborating with different um, students from other courses and seeing how you can work together. Um, 
to just go for it. And the students that leave here and who've had the best experience are the ones that just get involved in everything. And also enjoy it. God, this is an amazing like chance to have a go at everything in a safe environment. Um, you know, it sort of takes away some of the pressures that you have when you're a grown-up like me. Um, but, you know, just really enjoy it. Whatever your age as well, whether you're a mature student, you know, where, wherever you've come from in the country, just, you know, come in, have an open mind and really enjoy it and get involved. Finally then, if a famous person were to play you in a movie about your life, who would you choose and why? I'm not sure she'd be up for the job, but Helen Mirren. She'd need a bit of training, but I think she can handle it. Perfect. Thank you, Lucy. Thank you. <laughs>